Hi everyone, this is Dmitry from iRx.com. In this tutorial, I will show you how this whole flow works. Create a new composition. Let's add to timeline static image and scale it down to fit the frame. I'm using S hotkey to reveal scale parameters. Now we need to precompose this layer to make all flow works in real time. Select layer and go to layer precompose. In this window we need to check move all attributes into the new composition. Let's apply loop flow effect, choose layer, right mouse button, effects, hydraulics, loop flow. Now we need to draw a couple masks. With our layer selected, choose pen tool and draw them like this. First one and second. OK. Then we need to specify our mask here. Mask 1 and mask 2. Here I will show you how the looping works. Plugin takes area between this mask and makes two copies called layers. This layer is shifted on some distance and slides in the same direction. First layer changes transparency from 1 to 0 during loop. And second layer in opposite changes transparency from 0 to 1 during loop. You can see it on these ramps. We can temporarily turn off second layer to see how blending works in different situations. I also will turn off join the ground. Now I can see how the first layer is vanished over time with soft noise. By default, noise amplitude is set to 50. I will set it to 0 for now. And now you can see how the layer vanishing evenly. We can now add some noise to make this transition more noisy. Let's set amp to 200 just to see it more clearly. Now it gets uneven. We have noise preview feature just to see how it looks and adjust its size or offset. It's handy to make blend looks more natural with different images. For example, we can stretch it like this. In some cases it will work very good. We have another feature, wipe transition. By default it is set to zero. But if change it to 100, I will turn off second layer for now just to show you how it works. Now we see the wipe from right to left. We can make it more smooth. Ok, again, if this amplitude is set to zero, we have a linear transition or blend. It is uniform over mask. Let's set amplitude to say 30. Now wipe is very smooth. I will bring back second layer. Now you can see smooth wipe from right to left. Let's increase the amplitude and wipe is more hard now. With 50 blend it look more invisible. Also with wipe you can use noise. Let's increase the noise amplitude. I will show you without second layer. See, the wipe with some noise on the right side. These two features, uh, wipe and noise, allow you to make blend more natural in different situations. Ok, next, another feature. It is called Move Speed Ramp. It defines slight speed over the pass. Now, as you can see, the speed is same along the pass. But if we add keyframes and make them like this, just make it more smooth. Now I'll begin and end like stretching. Feeling like fabric is stretching. But if I bring it back, it looks now not good as before. I will make slow down again. In next tutorial I will show you another useful features. Thank you for watching.